So this is like a drum machine, but put through an amplifier to get it sort of all distorted and stuff. So again, sort of trying to use equipment that was around them, but always finding ways of, of sort of abusing it in a way and, 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 and um, uh, yeah, just trying to get sort of sounds that no one else was, was using. So I think we had a drum machine going through a guitar amp, but with mics in the room, so you can hear it sound slightly sort of roomy sounding. And it carries on usual Genesis sort of intro where things gradually come in. Tony starts playing the melody and and Phil always used to sing in a particular microphone with a particular um, compressor on it which made his voice sound more guttural as well and and he would sing very much to the sound that he was hearing through this equipment in his headphones so it's, it was all quite sort of all sort of thought out and you can hear where he's the guttural sounds and then here comes the famous laugh Oh no, sorry, there's another verse. Now we got Mike playing his guitar coming in. I mean, it's classic sort of record production where you gradually bring things in, you know, and they're all crescendos at the end. Yeah. There he goes, oh, it's a real sort of crack on the front of it. <laughs> that's the bit that's kind of borrowed from, from the message. I'm just sort of waiting for the, um, for the drums. So the, the, the drum loop is exactly the same that's been going on all the way from the beginning. Bass coming in for the first time. to edit some <laughs> Tony's keyboards are amazing here's the, the classic drum gated thing so you can hear the sort of similarity dum to dum 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 and then it shuts off dum to dum 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 and then there's if you took all the rest of the music away you have that sort of silence when the gate closes up but the trick was always to keep the drum sounding really big but also to have everything else because you've had everything else coming in keeping it all sounding big but the drums are still quite loud classic fill drum fills but 
but the crucial thing is there's no no symbols. If the minute you put symbols in there, it would mess it up sonically. And that was the thing with the intruder as well, no symbols at all. No, it sounds great still, doesn't it? <laughs> 